All right. Thank you all for being here. Um, today is Sunday, the 16th of December, 2018. Bray, you want to start off each day. We were talking before the recording. If, if you wake up and, and you're not with the Lord and the rapture hasn't happened, thank God for that day and use it to serve the Lord uh, in the grace message and uh, be thankful for it. It's another day to build fruit to your account as well. Uh, pray for your brothers and sisters in Christ. We have a number of people out today. Uh, Larry and Rosie. Larry's out in uh, San Francisco. Rosie's in L.A. visiting the family. Larry's working. Toby and Michelle out. Denise is out. Matthew's in Mississippi. Be in prayer for him. He's down there with his family. And uh, he, he's, he told me this morning he's, uh, he's dealing with other people about the grace message. He'll be in prayer. Rod and Gail, they did text me, but they'll be on their way. Pray for your civil authorities as well. SoCal, tentatively, we're looking for Sunday. March 10th, 2019, to have a, a Bible study and Q&A down there on, on that Sunday and, and to, to, to see the saints. Uh, this January, though, uh, we heard from Sister Marnie from Georgia. It's always a blessing to have Marnie come and visit us to see the saints. And um, she told us she'll, she'll be making her way out here in January. So we look forward to that. Uh, rent an offering. Uh, we're going to see that. If, if you're not part of our Grace Assembly in person, the best thing you can do is pray for us. People say, how can they get back? Uh, the only thing Paul says in his epistle that you can do from afar, he says, pray for us and give. So that's, you can have fruit about your account, be part of our ministry. And then feedback. I'm going to read the, the uh, email I received from a brother named Julius. It says, hi, my name is Julius. I've been watching a few of your videos lately for the last four days. No, I want y'all to, this is amazing. This guy gets it. I've, he's been watching for four days. And I realized that I was not living according to the way Paul is teaching. How about that? Nice. He recognized that at four, four days of watching our videos. And I didn't know anything about grace and truth until hearing you teach it correctly. I actually currently attend an apostolic church. And people fall out as they call it slain in the spirit. Mm. And people seem to be talking in tongues. There's even an apostle as they call him. Been there, done that. The bishop that we went to, the bishop, one day he just came, he says, I'm an apostle now. He just named himself an apostle, okay? Now watch this. He says, you bring up a lot of familiar scriptures that they misuse. So he'll hear scripture that we, I bring up in context, but they'll take out of context to use to, to motivate people. You bring up a lot of familiar scriptures that they misuse. And now I'm unsure about how I feel going there. Hmm. Four, four days, he's like, well, I don't know. I'm going to tell you, Brother Julius, um, it's unprofitable. It's, it's not good. Just keep, you'll get it. Watch this. I've been there too. Like, yep. so I can't go to this church anymore. Yep. <laughs> I tell people, if, they, if they're hearing the rightly divided truth of God's grace message through Paul, your own heart and spirit will say, I shouldn't be attending, but keep going. He says, I'm now, and now I'm unsure about how I feel going there. I feel like I need to say something. Yes, you do. That's the first thing you do. You go, I have to go and talk to the people there, right? Everybody has that response. All right, here we go. I'm also a musician. I play the bass guitar. Julius, we could use, we could use that. <laughs> we could use that. He, he says, I play the bass guitar. I know you're probably busy, but I appreciate you looking at this email. So Julius, Yes, it's busy. I get a lot of emails. Uh, it's thinking, wait a minute. Four days ago, I was thinking this way, living this way. Now I'm starting. The eyes of his understanding are being enlightened, okay? For four days, because, because he's curious and his heart desires to please God. By the way, he's responding the way people should respond. If you're hearing this for the first time, God wants you to be curious about what is this guy talking about and listen, be open, be, re can, be open to hear the truth, the word of God. I, I really enjoy your videos because it helps me understand the Bible in a way I never heard it before. I appreciate that, Julius. And I share that with Ryan because of his ministry in the Lord of getting these videos out and the rest of you guys for, for having a ministry. This is one of the best emails that I've received. I, I love these. I love this feedback and this, and this encouragement because here's a guy with an honest heart saying, four days of watching your videos, I've never heard it before. He didn't just you know, dismiss them. He really has, he, he, took, he, heard, he took it in. And um, thank you so much.